what point did you start uh, uh, experiencing with steroids and, and additional drugs? Uh, before my first competition, because I knew the guys I was competing against were using steroids. Everybody so was. I'm like, this is, you know, this is, uh, this is part of the game, right? And if you're going to compete without steroids, you're going to be at a great disadvantage. Not impossible, maybe, if you're genetically much more gifted than the other guys. Well, actually, my first competition uh, wasn't with the Federation. It was a local competition, Mr. Birmingham. And I won that while I was natural. And the, the guy that placed second and third, I, you know, I knew them. So I knew they were using steroids. And I was still able to beat them. And I dieted for like a week. Uh, natural. Yeah, and it's natural. But when I went to the Federation and I knew it was a different standard, then... Um, I started about 12 weeks before the competition. What did you start off? What was the first experience? Uh, so, so little to what people use now. But still, I f it was dramatic because it was the first time I ever touched anything. Uh, first thing I ever took was Dynaball. Okay. 20 milligrams a day of Dynaball. I took that for six weeks, and then I switched over to Prima one Primaball in shot a week and a little bit of Anabar, like 15 milligrams or something. That's kind of like bikini girls use that now. You and know? Primo is like pre-competition stuff. Yeah. Primo is not to really get you No, that to was when I was, you know, yeah. I did a little bit to build up, and then, then I came down with a diet. Got it. Uh, and I was in pretty good shape. I diet for like seven weeks or something. When did you really, ex because even when you went against Lee Haney, when you, get on, when you got yeah. on stage and you look at you, you look good. Yeah. You look like this guy can win, but you took it to a whole different level. So at what point did you kind of uh, take your game up and experience with well, different the, things? Well, the next level, I was just using steroids up to that point. So the next level was growth hormone, which was very expensive and not that available. But now I got second in the Mr. Olympia. So now I got income and I got contacts and I decided let's, let's try the growth hormone. I'm sure that my competitors are already using it or some of them. Um, so I started with that and that like enabled me to go to another level over the next few years.